Hey, all you manja cakes out there in the YouTube verse, Frankie Cappuccino with another amazing episode of MPW Into the Lair. As we've seen in these last few weeks in Into the Lair, the Phoenix has been rising, and that has not gone unnoticed by the brass in the, at MPW headquarters. So tonight, Commissioner Sicilian Assassin has sanctioned this match for the Phoenix to take on in a non-title match the Monster Pro Wrestling Heavyweight Champion, Magnificent Mitch Clark. We've heard Mitch Clark say that he's not going to put up that title until he finds a worthy opponent. Well, Phoenix has a chance to prove herself worthy against the champion tonight. So let's get to the match. Coming to the ring, the Phoenix. Hello, everybody. And making his way to the ring, the MPW Heavyweight Champion, Magnificent Mitch Clark. So Mitch making his way to the ring for this intergender wrestling match. He's got a point, Q. You know, I'm like I told you, uh, told the Manja Cakes out in the YouTube verse and everyone listening. I'm very impressed with Phoenix. I'm as woke as the next guy. I believe she deserves opportunities in MPW. But this is the MPW Heavyweight Champion, Magnificent I'm Mitch excited. Clark. I'm excited to go against Mitch Clark. I'm sure you are, Phoenix, but he's possibly the best MPW champion in the history of MPW. I don't know. I don't know. I don't like her chances. And, you know, Mitch Clark is throwing her a bone, but we'll see what happens. You know, Phoenix is such a talented wrestler. She's got, she's so skilled with her technique and has the aerial moves that, uh, yep, she is definitely an underdog. But you know what? I really believe she's going to give Mitch a run for his money, and I would love to see the upset. And I don't believe that Mitch has faced everyone in MPW. I can think of a few names that he seems to be ducking. Well, he doesn't believe they're worthy of a match. I think this match was made by Commissioner Sicilian Assassin. Otherwise, you think Mitch would agree to this? He's just doing it because he's being told to and he has no choice. Okay, so the match is underway. Phoenix getting all fired up and the two lock up in the middle of the ring. Very quickly, Mitch showing his strength. What's he gonna do here? Oh, takes a slap to the face right on Phoenix. Little Jackie Gleason there from Mitch Clark. Well, you know, Mitch, you know, he's, he's the champion and he deserves to be respected, but he's also a gentleman. He's not gonna hit a lady, but you know, I don't know what Phoenix thinks she's gonna do, rile him up, get him mad enough. Like, uh, that's just uh, poking the bear in my opinion. All right, so the two lock up again and uh, Mitch has a uh, top arm lock, uh, top arm bar, brings Phoenix down to the canvas. Has that locked in? Almost got a quick little pin there, but I knew Phoenix would pull out of that. She spins around, keeps the arm lock though. Look at that, she's reversed it. Has herself in her own top wrist lock. Oh, look, Phoenix using leverage to her advantage. Wow, takes a champion down. And look at that. Wow, that's a lot of pressure right in that bridge. She's putting full pressure onto that wrist. That has got to hurt. So Mitch Clark manages to roll out of it, but he keeps the top wrist lock in place. Nice takedown by Mitch Clark. We've seen him use this takedown a number of times. Both wrestlers on the canvas and that wrist lock is locked in good. Hard to tell who's got the, the lock on who right now. Wow, Phoenix trying to get an arm bar on uh, magnificent Mitch Clark. He's just not giving that separation in his hands. She's still pulling, trying to get that arm bar off. Mitch looking like he's struggling, trying to get out of it. Okay, well, now he's got that turned around. Oh, I thought he could have maybe had a pin there. He's got Phoenix picking her up. What's he going to do? Spinning her around? I don't know. It looks like Phoenix is holding on. He, he might be trying to throw her. Nice takedown by the Phoenix. Leg trip. Now she's going after the legs. Quick pin. No, just a count of one. Well, you know, Phoenix so far holding her own. 
Uh, magnificent Mitch Clark, you know, just toying with her until now. You know how Mitch likes to get under your skin by trying to humiliate you in that ring. Ooh, here comes one of Phoenix's big moves. And she's got him, and there you go, Hurricane Rana. Wow, that definitely took Mag Mitch Clark by surprise. But not enough to take him out. Well, you know, a few more, if she can execute a few more big moves like that, that really could turn things in her favor. Mitch Clark now in control, going after the leg of Phoenix. He's got an ankle lock, but Phoenix, like Mitch just said, she's pretty flexible. It's tough to get a submission hold on her because you can fold her up like a pretzel and she'll still keep coming. Look at the strong legs on Phoenix. She manages to kick Mitch Clark away. Now she's setting him up, but she got nice drop kick. Beautiful drop kick by Phoenix. She's setting him up. What's she going to do? And, oh, look at that. What's she got here? Going for a sunset flip. There you got go. It. Beautiful. The momentum kind of carried her through on that. Not the prettiest sunset flip, but it did its trick. Looked like she might have been going for a crucifix there. Changed to a sunset flip. Oh, Whoa. what a bulldog. And we've seen Phoenix execute that move a number of times. Nice to see Mitch Clark taking a bit of a beating here. You know, right now, I think Phoenix is, has got an upper hand and, and she's got some control that I haven't seen in a while. Oh, Mitch, Mitch just came out of his days here and now he's taking control of the match once again. He throws Phoenix against the ropes. Oh, oh. she's caught. So that's where the weight difference makes such a big difference. She is quite light and oh, backbreaker. And look at that. Wow, that's gotta hurt right in the small of the back. Puts, puts the backbreaker and then changes it into a submission stretch. Okay, so Mitch Clark has taken control of this match. Let's see what Phoenix has got, if she can turn this around. Right now, she's reeling from that last set of moves. Mitch Clark, look at that, grinding his the sole of his shoe right into the side of Phoenix's face. Hey, he's, uh, he's on the ropes. Come on, ref, tell him to break off the ropes. Hey, Mitch Clark is showing Phoenix what it means to be in the ring with the champion. Putting his hands on the ref. I don't know why the referees in MPW put up with this crap from Mitch Clark. Maybe it's time that a new ref comes in here and really shows some authority to this man. Hey, when you're the champ, you call the shots, Q. You know that, I know that. The guy, it's a golden rule. Whoever has the gold makes the rules, and that's what Mitch Clark is doing. So Mitch Clark executes a suplex. Phoenix reeling taking his time you know he knows that this is going to be an easy match wow so even the referee surprised at a pinfall well so far it hasn't been such an easy match though you know phoenix is uh, is uh, I, I think this may be you know a style of wrestling that mitch maybe isn't ready for she's she's every bit as as athletic as he is you know, the champ is ready for anything, Q, and there's no one that matches his technical prowess, his strength, and his will to win. That's why he's the champion. And he'll take down Phoenix, he'll take down Sultan, he'll take down Dark Horse, he'll take down anybody in the MPW roster, because that's how good he is. All right, so Phoenix gets whipped into the corner turnbuckle. Wow, she hit that hard. What's he doing here? Oh, setting her up on the on the middle turn. I don't know what's going on. Is this such a smart move? This is where Phoenix excels. And look at that. Kick right to the chest. Second kick right to the chest. This is where Phoenix wants to be. Is up on top. What's she got here? Hurricane Deed. No. Mitch Clark puts on the brakes. He's got her in a snake eyes position. No. Flips her around. Wow, just keeps spinning her into a power slam. Mitch just showing he can have his way with her Phoenix like a rag doll on Mitch's shoulder. Okay, so Phoenix kicked out of that one. Mitch. I'm surprised. I'll be honest, I'm surprised. There was a lot of impact in that. I thought that might have been the end, but looks like Mitch wants to punish her a little bit more, let her know that she's actually in the ring with the champ. And, you know, Mitch has got to be asking himself, what is it he's got to do to finish this off? So here it looks like he's going to whip her across into the ring, into the corner again. Oh, beautiful move by Phoenix to get out of the way. 
Kick to the midsection. Beautiful kick to the side of the face. And a second kick to the side of the face. Right down on the on the thigh. Oh! In Seguri to the champ's head. That took him by surprise. Going for the pinfall. Can she get it? Oh, both legs locked. I thought she might have a serious chance there. Look at that uppercut. You know, she's definitely got some muscle. She may be a small girl. Look at that off the ropes. Beautiful job, but caught in midair. Again. Oh, but oh, no. look at this into the birdie and down Mitch. Go. Wow. Didn't expect that from Phoenix. Oh, but Mitch kicks out. Phoenix is taking the champ by surprise. You know, using her aerial maneuvers, using her technical ability, and the champ looks a little stunned. Beautiful takedown once again by Phoenix. She has definitely rallied and is in control of this match. There it is, a big 6-1-9 right to the face. Mitch Clark definitely reeling. Phoenix once again going for the pin. Kick out by Mitch, though. Still keeping, uh, keeping on top of things, Phoenix. She's hitting him with everything she's got. Oh! Wheelbarrow Bulldog to the champion. Mitch rolls to the ropes. Smart move. But Phoenix still, still on top. Let's see what she's going to do okay, here. Okay, if she can execute something from the top rope, I really don't think Mitch will be able to come out of it. What's she got here? Oh, here we go. Oh, but Mitch held on to the rope. Wow. He's not letting go. That did not work in his favor at all. What's going to happen here? Oh, my goodness. Very vulnerable position for Phoenix. Boston Crab right in the middle of the ring. The champ knew exactly where he was. Hung on to that top rope so that Phoenix... Come on, Phoenix. Corona. Now he's got in a Boston Crab. She's right in the center of the ring queue. And that Nowhere is for it. Her to go. Nowhere for her to go. Oh. Well, she gave Mitch a run for his money. But the champ was able to come away with the win. He got the submission. I'm the best. Doesn't matter if you're man, woman, child, horse. It doesn't matter. I'm the best. Give me that. That's mine. Look at that. All mine. Mitch Pro Wrestling. The best. Uh, I don't matter know. Who you are. Doesn't matter where you're from. I'm the best. Was All what? me. All me. Oh, my goodness. Well, here's someone who might have something to say about that. Whoa, setting him up. What is Wrath doing? What a power bomb. Wrath out of nowhere attacking the champion. Well, there you go. Wrath, not happy with Mitch Clark. Wow, magnificent Mitch. You know, laying down that he is Monster Pro Wrestling, calling him Mitch Pro Wrestling, and the monster of MPW, Wrath, took exception. This is Tony T for MPW Wrestling. Right now, I'd like to welcome, representing the Savages, Wrath. Wrath, how do you explain your actions to what happened to Mitch Clark? Walk away. This way you see my eyes and know I am serious, Mitch. You've been here for four years. I've been here for 15. And you walk around with a title belt that you don't respect. I get it. You got talent. You got your MMA background. But this is wrestling. You are not big, you are not bad. You said something earlier, you've gone through every man in this division and you wrestled Phoenix. Guess what? You were right about that because now you face a monster. I am taking you on. I am taking that belt and I am leaving you bleeding, broken and bruised in that ring. Welcome to the void.